Chuck Fresh taking a look at the new Starfrit Rotator. We had the old version, figured it was time for an upgrade. So this thing comes with six blades, which is really nice. We got the white one this time. We had the black one last time, but the white one looks pretty svelte, right? Just take all these stickers and instructions off, and you can actually run this thing on AA batteries, which is interesting. And underneath the batteries, you got a couple more blades. So you've got about six extra blades and the one that's on the unit. So it comes with seven altogether. So you kind of figure out where to put the napkin under this for a real silly, easy cleanup. It's really cool. So you pop your potato right there on the spikes on the bottom and then put the big spike in on the top, kind of move the handle a little bit. And that red thing is actually your blade. That's what's actually going to peel your potato, which is going to save you tons of time. Not just potatoes, but apples, pears. You can even do uh, citrus zests with this thing. It's amazing. And it doesn't cut a lot of the potato out, which is really impressive. I thought it was going to take chunks of this potato out, but just the skin and just a little bit underneath, just enough to do a real clean peel. Look at that, no lines in between. People who invented this thing are genius. Cuts almost all the way down to the bottom, so very, very little waste, and you could trim the top and bottom off. That's kind of what we do. And you just pop it off, you're ready to go. How quick is that? No more scuffing your nails and cutting your fingers with potato peelers, and it's so much faster, too. It's really simple, too. You just pop it on the bottom, and then shove the top in. Not real hard to do. You just let this thing flip, the little red blade. It'll start there at the top and work its way down through this magic. I've got it plugged in here. Again, you can run it on batteries. I don't know why you need to do that. I sped it up a little bit just to show what it looks like. And you can also do squash zucchini. You could make uh, squash spaghetti if you run it through again. Take the, 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 the outer skin off and then run it through again. You can make squash pasta. How cool is that, right? You could do this with um, french fries as well. You could do this with potatoes. Just a whole bunch of different things. Oh, they also improve the blade too. You can pop it off for easy washing. Very, very cool machine.